Hello my friends, I'm Mr. Mokulover and thank you for joining me here of course in Old World Blues playing as that Boneyard Military Junta. Last time we took out all of Colorado, took out the Pacific Northwest and now we are, well, we still gotta beat up the Red Sun Republic but we also need to go to war with those folks over here in the Phoenix Republic. So we're gonna try to take out everyone else in today's episode. Finish these guys off. Uh, might just find anyone on anyone else. Good, we're doing Twisted Hairs and then Flagstaff. So that's going to take a little while. we got to get to El Malpais, which is very good, very good. And then go to war with these guys. How strong is the Phoenix Republic, actually? 170 divisions, 2 manpower. That's, that ain't much. And we're waiting to get our soldiers to places and away from places. And there goes the Red Sun Republic. Very nice. Beautiful, my friends. Beautiful. Hope you're all, all having a great day. Let's keep researching some stuff. You are out of a job. What are you, me? And then, let's see. We're just going to go do this. And boom. There you go. You're going to defend this area. See what they do about that. Maybe they'll do something great. Maybe they won't. And beat them up. A casual one to buckle my shoe. Cool. There you go. There, there, there. And there you go. We're going to put you over here because that's where you belong. And give our guys a few more days to get to where they need to be. Oh, you're also down here too. Oh. Cool. You guys can go like that then. And then we, we, we can redo you guys and y'all do that then. There you go. Almost perfectly balanced. As it should be. So you guys are taking forever to get over here. And we, need, we are going to go, to go to war regardless by Ju January. Not June, but January 30th. Well, that'll be muy bueno. Even if they're here, even if they're not here, we're still going to go to war on that day. By that day, really. Because everyone else is itching for a fight. Good, and we spread their divisions up pretty nicely, actually. They, not bad, not bad. Two versus, versus two or four or whatever. Not bad. It could be much worse. And you're not even here on the line. My goodness, the APCs. They are some of the slowest creatures on Earth. Alright, we got to go to war since we have... We, 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 can, we just can't just wait for APCs. Uh, you're so slow. I mean, 9 kilometers? Yeah, I don't think so. You can go at least 13, so. Alright, you guys. Well, you guys can go right on in. Just take them out. And you guys are getting beaten up quite a bit. How's the air... No air superiority. Well, yeah, it might help if we threw some airplane bases around here. Yeah, that might help. Maybe. Ah, you're getting attacked everywhere. Beautiful, my friends. Beautiful. Are they piercing us over here, maybe? Maybe not. Oh, are you? Oh, I told you guys to attack. Ah, eh, let everyone attack. They're out of manpower, anyways. It doesn't really matter. Cool. And we've already broken over, so it doesn't even really matter. Pretty good. Oh yeah. Also, thank you for breaking my ciphers. I guess we'll use ours against you. Beautiful. Beautiful. We're done with that. All that stuff. Very good. Very good. Very good. And actually, let's go ahead and ask settlements to help out. Help. Ask followers about the settlements. We only get a little less than 2,000 people every day. Let's restore Fort Carson. Pretty good. Also, let's see. We can also do ruthless drills, expel the rift raft, sell some outdated equipment. I thought there was something else I want to do. Ah, breach the facilities for strange places. The wasteland is filled with the remains of a bygone age. Perhaps we can find something amongst the ashes. Yes. We might find something. That'd be kind of cool. Plasma weaponry! Many have wondered how the U.S. Army learned to build plasma equipment, and it seems that Area 51 has the answer. Some of the schematics aren't in a language or code we can't comprehend, but we've pieced together enough to details to build the guns. Amazing. we got little green men. What does that say? There it is. As any nation unravel the mystery of Area 51. Wow. That's actually pretty, pretty darn good. Now we can probably research plasma weaponry, hopefully. That'd be kind of nice. That'd be very nice. Uh, take them out before they become a problem. Hey, look! The Phoenix Republican... Phoenix Republic is looking pretty darn small. Do you guys have no orders? Oh, that's a sin. That's a sin and a half. No, no, no. You got orders. You definitely got some orders, son. Very good. Just in case, let's build some more air bases around here. This is very soft. Arsenal democracy, here we go. Do that. Do that, just in case. Maybe build up some infrastructure around here, too. That'd be kind of good. Build up all around Flagstaff, because we can. Uh, 
beautiful. And let's see, casualties, 600, less than 1,000 versus 38,000. That's not bad. I, I, I like that. That's pretty good. More war support, sure. Very good. Yuma is encircled, and we shall have it soon. Oh, you guys. Tanks. Yeah, you did a great job, Tanks. You did a tremendous job. Keep going down here. Heavy Mountain Trooper Engineering. Can we grab... Yes, we can. Yes. What a way to end this campaign with Plasma Weaponry. Or Winchester P-94 Plasma Weaponry. Oh, what a great thing. I love the Plasma Weaponry. There we go. Do something like that. Go crazy. Go ham. Have a good time. You know. Uh, I can't imagine they'd hang on for that much longer. Ah, encirclements. Beautiful. Oh, I love it. Oh, yeah. Overrun them. And for you guys, I'm going to put you all, like, right here. I could, you put, I could put these guys down here, but, you know, whatever. Let's see. They have still a lot of divisions in two suns. But it won't really matter if we just beat up and take all the Phoenix Republic's territory. And we've linked up and cut off Southern Phoenix from Northern Phoenix. Even though now we both have both Phoenixes. If we have two Phoenixes, why don't we just combine them into one? Take the little tile. Thank you very much. I'm just fighting on these guys, right? I am. And less than two months. Time. Very good, very good, very good. Ah, uh, there goes the Phoenix Republic. And the, their little puppet? No, other puppet. Okay, well, whatever, that's fine. No worries, we shall have them too. Beautiful, my friends, beautiful. Now let's all surround these guys and take them out. They're looking pretty large, not gonna lie, looking pretty darn large. Uh, if that's the case, I'm actually gonna send you guys over here because to, you guys are probably gonna be able to go to war with these guys first, maybe? Hold on, let's double check. No, actually, no. Go back the other way. I was right about this. There you go. A little bit of tug, tug, tug boats, patrol boats. Sure, why not? Another tank or two. Tanky, 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 tanky. Another dude or two. Uh, let's go ahead and move these guys over. That'd probably be better. Lund. And Gator Ranch. Infrastructure problems or prioritization. Sounds like a smart idea. 600. How fast can we get 650? Well, in a single day, we just got almost roughly 4 air XP. Another 4 almost. Well, it's about 3.7 every day. That's not bad. We beat him up. Take the capital. 38,000 losses, 50 divisions. Well, that's going to go drastically down very soon, which would be very nice. No, they're just they're just doing work. Uh, you guys could actually probably just end up going this way. That'd be fine with me. And you guys can just go take those guys out or something. Oh, well, that's not good. Where is the capital? It's all the way down there. Okay, that's fine. It's going to take a little bit longer to take these guys out, but that's okay with me. Since these guys are almost done as well. 15 days, 2 weeks. And we almost have... Ah, eh, we have TR City. And there you go. Not too bad. Very good, very good, very good. You guys, come up here. Hang out, have a good time. We should be pretty good on that. So, then you guys are going to come around here. Do that. Oh, wait. Is it flags that we're trying to take out? No, we're not. That's really bad. 300, oh my goodness, 300 days, that's so long. So long. Uh, I don't don't want to put anyone Hooper Dam. Or really there either, so. Uh, you guys can be doing that. The pass, very good. Give me you guys. I want you all right here as well. Because I think things would be fun to throw right there. And you guys, just prepare yourselves for, these, for this group. That'd be nice. So we got to get Chihuahua. Alright, we should have air bases, we should have enough people here. Let's go ahead and go to war, see what happens. Maybe it's good, maybe it's not. They immediately attack me. Totally fine with me. Bring it on, boys and girls. Bring it on. Oh, I forgot there's a little hole there. Whoops, my bad. Maybe don't bring it on. Don't bring it on. Alright, there you go. Losses. Thousand versus zero. Versus three. Seventeen. Alright, you know, makes sense, you know. You can't be perfect. But now run them over and you're a scrap. Trucks and tanks. Very good, very good. <coughs> Excuse me. 
<coughs> hmm. I don't know where that came from. No idea. How long will it take to go to war with these guys? It takes forever. 230 days. That's a bit too much, man. Just a bit too much. But we can core something. Alright, let everyone go now. Oh, wait, hold on. Why did you steal these divisions? Hold Why did... What? No. You take these guys back. You flippin' thief. You are a thief. And Dennis, I will... N yeah, that's right. You, sh you deserve to get wounded after you steal my stuff. Or steal other people's stuff. Mmm, that's not cool, man. Stealing ain't cool. And we're just beating him down. Beat, 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 beat. Losses, about 252 versus 20,000. 21,000, not bad, not bad. Pretty good numbers, do we have enough robots to contain every everything? Good, patrol boat hulls, anything else? Yes. Armored carriers. And some airbase stuff, very good. Um, I mean, yep, eh, it didn't really matter. Cool. Awesome. You guys, come over here, get ready. And then you guys come over here and do that. Now let's we'll put this up a little bit better. One, two, three. Good. 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 And now we're just waiting for that last justification to finish. Which hopefully shouldn't take too long, but you never know. Hmm, how many more days have we got? You know what? That's not bad. Let's finish these guys off first. Eh, we might call these guys in, we might not. And then we can start justifying on other people. Three. Come on, come on, come on. Let time go on. Quickly, quickly, quickly. And... Good. Now, let's immediately justify on Flagstaff, because they don't deserve to be there. 50 days, that ain't bad. 50 days versus... 155? It might be best if we just... Eh, 135 isn't too bad. That isn't too bad. Alright, we're just moving in. They don't really want to defend their lands, except at Hoover Dam. Alright, well, whatever. But okay, I mean, if we, if we just take Bonelli Landing, I mean, that'd be fine with me. Hmm. Please move, guys. Please. That'd be kind of nice. Nope. Nope. Too late for you. And there they go. Cool. So, I will be right back, and we will resume once our justifications are finished. Alright, my friends, and we are back. So... Uh, right now, I basically let time go on a little bit more. I went to war already with Flagstaff. I mean, they're already trying to fighting us, or they're trying to fight us. And, well, I haven't taken them out yet. As well as Pecos Colony, as well as Las Granjas. They're actually beating up our infantry just a little bit. But, uh, it'll be what it'll be. Just because, well, I've justified on these two. I'm justifying on these folks. But we can't go to war with the Cartel de Sinaloa. Because, just like the Denver Quarantine Zone and Hoover Dam and Base... Old World Blues, you can't go to war with them, so we are going to have to use cons commands to go to war with those folks. But let's go ahead and finish off this little war over here in Flagstaff. Now, it looks like we can't really win just yet. They're pretty pretty strong around here. Pretty amazingly strong. Uh, we're doing a ton of damage, but we still can't quite win in most areas here. So far, casualties have been like 3,000-ish versus 8,000, 8,500, 17,000, 186. I think I just went to war with Pegasus Colony too. Cool. I can't imagine them really holding on for that much longer in Flagstaff. Because right now, they got about a thousand manpower and it's going to be dropping as we're doing a ton of damage. And there they go. So, very good. Very good. Thank you, Flagstaff. Your independence will not be here anymore. Good. We got some carrier escorts, which we don't really ever use. And bear packs. Next up, we're going to throw you guys on the line down here. Because we can. And then do the same thing right there. So, like I said, we're going to, have to use Kant's commands to attack the Sinaloa Cartel. You know, we might try to enable invasion of these guys down here, too. Uh, these guys. This cartel. Uh, 2,000 manpower. Oh, maybe not. Probably not, actually. But we can still beat them up and blow them up. Cool. Alright, so you guys, y'all are just hanging out. I think it's time for us to maybe push ahead. Push ahead, finish them off, get to the cartel, finish those guys off. You guys got a lot of guys around here. 
Let's see what we can do with a few divisions. And you guys, you guys, you guys. Let everyone go ahead. Finish them off. Have a good time. Do we have any cryptology? No, we do not. But we have 3 to 4 political power. Oh, wow. Critical. Foreign powers activities are destabilizing the country. Well, that's not very good. Old Chico, welcome. Old Chico, we have only over 300,000 manpower. Never enough. Never, ever enough. Uh, that might be a little hard to break into, not gonna lie. But Las Granjas is gone. Beautiful. So you guys are over here. Uh, you know what? Try to help break over here too. I'd actually kind of appreciate that. You guys. Well, this looks terrible. So we're going to manually do this. Actually, you know what? I'm going to use you guys for this. Five at a time. Let, we can let time go on, though. Let time go on so it doesn't take forever. Five. Let's get four. Uh, sure, I guess four right there. That's fine. Since we've got quite a big army at this point. Four more. Right there. Let time go on. Let our guys take out... Los, Los Pecos, is it Pecos Colony? Something like that. Yeah, something like that. Uh, I'll make it five, why not? I could use his forces there. One, two, three. Right there, my friends. One, two, three, four. Yep, we're good enough. Fleet. Oh, I was also researching some extra planes, which at this point, research really means nothing since we already have every, everything we really need. And five more. Right there. Very good, very good. And we are missing... 2.1 1, million infantry equipment. Yeah, 2.1. And that's just because the counter has gone over the limit, in which I don't really care. We'll get that fixed regardless, eventually. Let's see. Ah, you guys first. I did? Oh, I probably lost like... Four, any divisions now? Maybe, maybe I didn't lose anything. Ah, good. We can go to war with those guys. That's honestly fine with me. You know what? Let's just go to war. Navy, what are you up to? Nothing? Okay, that's good. You're hanging out, having a good time. Go and get yourself deployed. And we should do okay if we fight these guys immediately. Do they have a big old navy? No, they don't. Uh, just do that. I don't really care. I really don't care. There you go. The fleet should be able to take care of them. But I could be wrong. Ooh. Four right there. Uno, dos, tres, cuatro. Usually I don't do wasteland conquests like this. But I did want to see if we could like take these guys out. Like the Sinaloa Cartel and Santa Ana. Because in at the time of this recording for Sweet Home California, they really can't do very much. So, I just wanted to see what would happen. Obviously, you can't take them out unless you use console commands, which we will do in just a moment. One, two, three, four. Pop, 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 pop. And, oh, god dang it. I was just about done there. Uh, that's okay. Beautiful. Oh, the waterways. I could just let them in. That is another strategy we could employ. But nah, we don't want them into our lands. Two, three, four. Good. There we go. Very nice. And right there. Oh my god, there's so much land here. This is probably one of the worst parts of Mexico. Just trying to get in it. Just trying to get into it. Good, good, good. Well, you might need more than one division there. Speed up time a little bit more. Uh, hmm. You know what? I, I, I really don't care. I really don't at this point. There you go. You know what? Just have a fallback line. We'll push them over eventually. So, there you go. Makes it easy. And there you go. Make it easy. Really can't be dealt with doing that. Cool. Let's let time go on. Let's get this thing real quick. Yeah, we're pretty much doing that. Nice. Naval stuff. Internal bombs. Whatevers. Do that one. Do that one. Now we have to use console commands, unfortunately, to do what we must. And uh, maybe get some more infrastructure for the areas that are most important or that will be most impacted. Oh, uh, we already did that one. Let's go with that one. Aggression. Very good. Come on. Thank you. Thank you. And muy bueno, my friends. Muy bueno. 
All right, so we got guides in the line. Now, unfortunately, we will have to use console commands to break into the enemy's lands. All right, sorry about this. Allow Diplo, so we can just do whatever we want against these guys, and there we go. You know what? Let's have a little bit of fun. Let's declare a war on Santa Ana 2 at the same time. There you go. And now, I guess just mush down here. I, I don't really care. Good, good, good. Mush, mush, mush. Do these guys even have an army? I mean, they've been here the entire game. Look, oh, no, they don't. Well, alright. That works for me. That actually works out very well for us. Go ahead, guys. Have a good time. You guys do the same sort of deal. Head on down there. Have a good time. See what you can do about destroying everyone around here. And have at it. Alright, we got some of these guys. Got a little bit of resistance. No one cares. And I do have a cup of buttermint tea with me here to aid us in our journey down through Mexico. Okay, that was really fast. That was so much faster than I anticipated. Wow, I set up all that for nothing. So be it. You guys come right... Well, hmm, maybe not. You guys come... Do all that. You guys... Come over there. And then you guys... Go right there. There you go, perfect. Close enough. And there you go, our navy. You might want to slink yourself into here maybe a little bit too. If they have ships, they should have some sort of ships. How strong is this cartel? It should be pretty strong. I think they're, yeah, 115 divisions. 1,000 manpower, that ain't too bad. Let's get some air bases down here, but we're going to probably need it. At least a little bit. Boom, boom. Maybe get some radar. Radar's always very nice to have. Work on the air bases, that'd be good. Infrastructure would also be very smart to work on as well. Ah, we can actually push them in. Nice. Very good, my friends. Very good. You might as well. You might as well. Ground pounders. Very good. Cryptology. Well, I don't think we can do very much else with cryptology for now. But hey, if you want to see what Santa Ana's up to, just gonna do all this stuff. Oh, he even owns Honduras. Alright, cool. Very nice. Very nice. Get some tactical bombers because we can. Cryptology. Well, I don't think anyone else exists. A good decrypt. Like New Vegas, but they're my puppet already, so it wouldn't really even matter. We're going to need a little bit more energy. Uh, New Vegas, would you mind trading me a little bit? There you go. That should help a little bit. Very nice. Losses thus far. 400 versus 9,000, and then versus 700. Not bad. Twice in two lifetimes, there goes Santa Ana. Uh, no ship losses yet, or at least I don't see any. Uh, that's probably... Most people don't really care about the Navy, and to a degree, I don't either. But I would lo love to see it. just a little bit more naval expansion, maybe other, you know, countries getting options to emphasize their Navy. I don't know, something like that. I think that would be quite a bit enjoyable for some people. I know it wouldn't be everyone's cup of uh, tea, but I think that'd be kind of a cool addition that they could throw in sometime. You know, I, I know they have a roadmap and stuff like that, but I'd really love to see just a little bit more focus on naval combat. I mean, you could perhaps the devs could lower the amount of time it takes to train navies. I know Mexico, especially Chichen Itza, Nueva Atzalan, maybe even some, they have quite the focus on naval production and naval power and projection, which is great, but other there are other states too that could probably use more as well. I don't know. We'll see what happens. The devs are, you know, probably great people. They put a ton of work into this, so I'm excited to see what they come up with for future additions to this mod, especially the base Old World Blues, as well as Sweet Home California, and the mod compilation as well. Always interested in seeing what the devs, and all devs, are able to create. Always interested. We'll go over there. Torpedo bombers, those sound nice. Cool. Airship reliability, sure. And we built up some other place. Cool. Combat blimps, awesome. Assault airships, they're absolutely not worth it. I understand why they cost so much, but they're absolutely not worth it. You should never build them. That's okay. Uh, this betterment tea is pretty darn spot on. Amazing. Let's see anything over here. No. Redding. Sure. Finally, we can core Redding. We're actually coring. Oh, hello. All of California, which is very nice. And we still own New Vegas. They're basically under us. Actually. Hmm. 
Bop, bop. Let's make sure that they stay under us. Yeah. Good. We're going to really emote them as fast as possible. I can't imagine Santa Ana you're holding on for that much longer, which is a good thing. That's okay. So how much more can we spam this? Boom, 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 boom. Cool. Transport gliders, awesome. Cargo planes, sure, why not? Why not? Uh, you guys are all doing stuff still, which is great. Tempico will be the, is the capital. And there goes uh, Santa Ana. I'm glad that we only have to go Santa Ana. I'm glad he owns all this. Because it's so much easier to take him out, take out than all these divided Mexican states when you play the base game. Or base Old World Blues. Uh, very good. Very nice. So. Uh, oh, an early death. Error. Well, it's not 2292. It's not that early, man. Now, I was hoping to maybe, like, straight up annex these guys. Occupy territories. No, not quite. Wow, look at that. Almost half a million manpower. Uh, I do want to see. It's 13 days at a time. I want to see how much it would cost for me to, like, straight up just annex uh, New Vegas. Get out, get out of there. Cool. Let's grab you and do that, 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 that. Build, 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 build. They don't need to tell me where they're going. Direct rule from LA. And now this should be going down just a little bit faster. We're super close. We've gone this far in the video long enough, so just a few more days, and we might be able to straight up annex them depending on the cost. If it's too high, then we won't. But it looks like it's going to cost me at least 200 more political power, which we don't have time for. we got other things to do today. So, I guess that's the campaign, my friends. That is the campaign for playing as the Boneyard Military Junior Junta, or the remains of L.A., and we basically took up the entire wasteland. I enjoyed this campaign quite a bit. And you know what? I hope you enjoyed it as well. If you did, consider leaving a like. Subscribe if you're new. Check out my Discord link in the description below. You know all the normal stuff by now. Uh, and like I said, hope you enjoyed it. And I will see you all in another campaign tomorrow. Thanks for watching, and have a great rest of your day.